share some oh, share some discords with the phone. Da, 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 da. If the music's too loud, let me know. Oh, hope the internet don't bug out like it did uh, on the last stream I did of Division Two. So totally ticked me off. Okay, Discords. <clears throat> Discords pop up. Da, 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 da. I am going to get through Metal Gear series. They'll be eventually uploaded to YouTube. Because if I uh, stream through Twitch to YouTube, you know, using the Aircast, then the Twitch ads will show up on the YouTube side, which is totally freaking weird. They didn't before because I wasn't monetized or affiliated, so didn't have to worry about them then. Okay. A few more discords to share too. And I'll be able to get started. Of course, right off the bat, I'm going to be having a sniper battle with Sniper Wolf. It'll be the second battle with her. <clears throat> and I hope I do good. <laughs> Because I have very, very limited cover. Let's see, start game. And then now. Dun, 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 dun. <clears throat> Cause it games and demos. It's weird. Okay. Um. Okay. I don't have to do that. All right. Press options button. Load game. Snowfield. Yeah. Actually. Um. After. After one, I kind of started it over and got to uh, where I had to be tortured. Because, depending on what you do, the end of the game is different. So, okay, out here in the snowfield. All right, so I gotta, I'm gonna clip that. Yep, that's what I was doing when I stopped. <clears throat> so. Da -da -da -da. Oh, what the holy heck and freaking crap is that? <clears throat> okay. Alright, now. Let's get started. Okay, so I got a battle sniper. Let's we'll see. I'll have to have... Let's see. Body armor, rations, and the diets of ham. So... Start off by having that equipped. And then, of course, equip and unequip the sniper rifle. Okay. Here we go. Oh, yep, you run until, you know, you get shot at by her. And then you go to stand there right, right in the freaking open and get on your codec Snake, call. Are you okay? Otacon, were there any other stealth prototypes? No, there? there were only five. So, this okay. is the stealth only camouflage five. then. What are you talking about? <clears throat> Someone's aiming at me in the middle of this blizzard. It's her. Wolf? Sniper Wolf? Yes, it's her. Yes. It's definitely her. Otacon, you sound like you're happy. No, I'm not. So then not. what is it? Snake, please don't kill her. Are you insane? Please. She's a good person. You'd know that if you talked mm -hmm. to her. Listen to me, kid. She's a merciless killer. 
I can see you perfectly from here. <laughs> I mm -hmm. told you. All my lurkers are here. Quit the hunt. Kamari, Diva, Jedi, and Cloud. No, you can't. <clears throat> Don't get between a wolf and its prey. <clears throat> Don't get between a wolf and its prey. The storm. Uh, you see, oh, yeah. Women naturally make better soldiers. Oh, they do. Wolf, don't do this. Oh, I didn't know that. Snake, I'm near. Well, there are a lot of great Patrick women soldiers out there, you know. A lot of it's great women, you know, in business, and industry, right? labor jobs, well, I'm going to send technical you jobs. Letter, my dear. Do you know what that is? It's a bullet straight from my Also, gamers. A lot of women are Please, great wolf. gamers. Snake, no! Quiet! <clears throat> don't hey, get nerdy. away! Now I'm gonna pay you back for Meryl. You men are so weak. You can back to work on a Metal Gear series. Get done with one, I'll go to two, and then three. Which hopefully, you know, the new three. Okay, so. Alright, where did I go? go do? I gotta go over here. Okay, so. Uh, Alright, we're not gonna let's try and aim up, find her first. Find where she's at. Where are you at, woman? Gotta find her first. I wanna know where she is. Okay, she ain't gonna be there. Oh, there she is. Oh, and she's aiming right at me. Well, holy freaking crap, woman. Gotcha. Damn it. Oh crap. Where was she at? She moved. If I can find where she moved. Okay, not that far. I pressed the wrong damn button. Let's see. Um we yeah, square to fire. I don't know why I screwed up. Where's she at? I know she's round. Where you at? Where'd you go? Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Okay, she's hiding behind that one. I'm gonna have to take another dice of ham. Put the armor back on. Come on, peek out. Peek out. I know you're gonna peek out. Come on, peek out. Come on, left or right. Come on. Come on. Oh, dang it. Woman. See, she's got a lot of things to make take cover behind. And I don't think I can shoot her arm. But as long as I can get on any part of her body, get shots. Come on. Uh-oh. Dies in time. Okay, only got four more of them. Come on. See, it'd be nice if I could just hit her right in the elbow. But it won't let me, so... Oh, damn, woman. Ow. She got me again. Find where she's at now. Ow. Okay, where's she hitting me up? Okay, I gotta find her again. There she is. Oh, she hit me at the same time, too. Holy crap. We both hit each other. Come on, where'd you go, woman? There she is. Oh, that was such a close one. Come on, what are you doing? What are you doing, girl? 
Come on. Got her. <clears throat> Woo! Okay. Okay, and I gotta... Yeah. Just run towards and a little cutscene will start. This game was made in 1998. sniper you know you she could have killed snake with that first shot when he ran out of the snowfield if she wanted but the rumor was she likes to play with her prey you know she likes to to toy with them you know hurt them a little bit make them suffer make them worry get them scared The first one I got to the point before fighting the sniper is like, I never got the suppressor for the SOCOM pistol, and never got the body armor, so I Google searched to find out where they were again, and then uh, loaded in the game, went back to those areas, got them, and that body armor helps you take a lot less damage, you know, from enemies having that body armor equipped. And the Aleuts revere them as honorable cousins. They call <clears throat> mercenaries like us dogs of war. Dogs of war. It's true. We're all for sale at some price or another. But you're different. Untamed. Solitary. You're no dog. You're a wolf. <laughs> you're a wolf. Who are you? A blonde wolf. Are you Saladin? Wolf. <clears throat> you spared Meryl's life. She, she was never my real target. I don't kill for sport. Rest easy. You'll die as the proud wolf you are. I finally understand. I wasn't waiting to kill people. I was waiting for someone to kill me. A man like you. A hero. Please 
set me free. Uh. Oh, here comes Articon. Why? I loved you. The first love of Otacon. Well, he had a crush on her. He fell in love with her, but she wasn't in love with him. She just liked him, you know, let her feed the wolves and everything. She's part of me. Everyone's here now. Condos. I'm going to the underground base. We're out of time. I know. You'll have to protect yourself now. Don't trust anyone. Yeah. If I can't stop Metal Gear, this whole place will probably be bombed to hell. Yeah. We might not meet again. I'll <clears throat> hang on to my codec. I want to keep helping. You can leave any time. Well, of course you can keep helping. Get a head start. <clears throat> a head start on your new life. <clears throat> oh. Snake! What was she fighting for? What am I fighting for? What are you fighting for? If we make it through this, I'll tell you. <clears throat> yeah, I will tell okay. you. Okay, I'll be searching too. Oh, well, search on there, young man. Search on. Well, I don't know. I just felt like saying it, you know. <clears throat> okay. Seven. Okay, what's this one do? Okay, six. Let's get the thermal goggles and look. Oh yeah, got claymores. All right, I'm full of claymores. Ration. Stun grenades. Diazepam. Okay. I know there's another door over here on this side. Place number on it. Six. <sighs> well, there's a bunch of bullets. Everything goes is clear. USC one sniper ammo. Thomas. That's the machine gun. Another door. That one's six. Oh. Just look in here. Work on the ground. 
If there's any traps, no. I'll need chaff grenades for those. Grenades and chaff grenades. Okay. I'm just running all around just to look. Because life is full. PSG one bolt should be full by now. Oops. There we go. Anything back here? Nope. under it? Nope. Sometimes there are items underneath vehicles. Okay, that's a one. Okay, there's something there, so put thermal goggles up. Okay, no trap floors, but there's cameras. So, chaff grenade. Carbore Vox C. Okay. See, the Carbore Vox is you can use to uh, get inside the back of one of the vehicles. A quick Carbore Vox. And then it's like a fast travel. It'll take you to whatever the destination is on the box. So, like, see the one I just picked up? Snowfield. B, Nuclear Warhead Storage Building. And A, the heliport. <laughs> the three areas so there's only three cardboard boxes so if I got in the back of the vehicle and done B it would take me to that building a it would take me to that okay six and there's that one right there that I couldn't open which is seven so later on I'll have to find out what that one is okay okay there's cameras so this here you know normally you know to have to change discs but I don't have discs so she says insert disc two boom it's automatically being you know now checking because this is all you know digital and everything now so but if I was on a ps1 then I would have had to you know open it up and then take you know the disc one out and put the disc two in Okay, there's a soldier there. Walking around. Let's see. Shh. I don't think he's going to get on this side of it. Eventually, he'll come back. <clears throat> oh, what did he Is he going? Oh, yes, he is. What was that noise? Hmm. 
Oh, you're going to walk back this way, huh? Easier just to get rid of them. Stun grenades. <coughs> <coughs> There's a camera down there. <coughs> okay, operate that. Okay, so gotta come over here. Just hold on. If I let go, I fall and die. gonna come back up he's got his rounds to do <clears throat> of course you could unequip your weapon be able to sneak up behind him and then see, I think it's tap like your square button don't worry they can't look up they can only look forward so he won't be able to see me want to get caught. Let's see where Jolly goes. I'm just going to go back down. I think anything else is over here. No. Holy heck is he doing? It's like he got confused or something. <clears throat> what the heck is he doing? Well, I think he just got glitched out. I think he got glitched out. Yeah, but he got glitched out. <laughs> what a dummy. <clears throat> yeah, he got glitched out.
Yep, he's glitched out. He's definitely glitched out. Over there on this side, yeah, see there's a ration or ammo. I don't remember how in the heck. Oh yeah, from up on the other side. Steam. You gotta watch the steam. You don't wanna get hit by the steam. Oh, yep, yeah, see? Don't wanna get hit by the steam. Ow. Damn it, really. See what those are. I know there's some type of bullets. Where's the Okay, let's go. Okay, circle of zoom in, X to zoom out. I know they're bullets, so I don't think I'm gonna worry about them all that much. <clears throat> okay, there's cameras here. More bullets and that right there. Missiles. Okay. <clears throat> oh, damn it. How about that? been since forever since I played this. Put these bolts here. Okay, so calm there, pull. <clears throat> Probably should have did a save, but it does like a basically auto save every area you go to. Okay. Let's equip thermal goggles, see if there's any traps or anything. Okay, nothing up on this side. Oh, wait, there's something there. Okay, Fama's bullets. bullets okay doing a lot of the farmers bullets the machine gun so calm okay see press square to fire hold down square for fully automatic Okay, let's do Kodak call. Oops, pause button. If you take that 
cargo elevator down, you'll wind up in Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. Okay. Okay, let's call Mei Ling. Do a save. In China, they say <clears throat> it's better to live ugly than to die beautiful. I think it's but I want to live beautiful. Once you're dead, you'll never have another chance to be happy. I can't understand people who want to die before their time. Please, Nick, promise me that you'll come back alive. I'll do the best I can. <clears throat> okay. Nice quick pause there. Okay. Let's go ahead and try to call everybody. Metal Gear is straight down. <clears throat> Better move it. Better move it. There's no move time. it. The terrorists are ready to launch. They are. are all finished. The government can't cave in to terrorist demands, but they're yeah, threatening no, 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 a nuclear here. weapon. They've made their final decision. U.S. government never White gives in to so terrorists. Inflexible. They never do. Colonel, is there still something you're hiding from me? Stay, please. <clears throat> Just concentrate on stopping them, okay? Okay. Okay. Wait, wait a minute, I got it. Oh, oh, damn it. Okay, let's see. Equip a weapon. I haven't gotten equipped yet. Um, and talk to her about. Okay, let's do the stinger missile. Talk to Nastasha. She's the weapons expert. Whatever weapon you have equipped, great. then she'll tell you about that weapon. Device, so once they locked on, they will automatically pursue the target. To lock on, all you have to do is line up the crosshairs. Stingers are very potent, short range, low altitude SAMs. In Afghanistan, the Mujahideen shot down hundreds of Soviet aircraft with them. In fact, they were forced to change their tactics. One of my favorite hmm. horror books is called Stinger, and my favorite cocktail is a Stinger. I guess you could say I've got a thing for stingers. Oh, I guess you do. Hmm. Okay, try and call him. Master, you and I, we're nothing more than dogs, are we? That's not like you, Snake. Don't let what Sniper Wolf said bother you. Listen, there's <clears throat> not a soldier alive that doesn't question mm -hmm. himself. If there is one, he's nothing more than a murderer. Nothing more a than a murderer. Like Wolf, a soldier who's looking for nothing more than their own death is no good to anyone either. Once she started to look for death, it was all over. That's how you'll end up too, Snake. Okay. Okay. I know you can't contact Meryl. She's a she's a prisoner, so no response. Okay, I already talked to Otacon. Try Deep Throat, see if I can talk to him. Nope. He's the um uh, cyborg ninja. Okay. Okay, quit that. But uh, uh, let's go to the control panel. Damn control panel. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh, I had to be on the very end of it. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> oh boy, battle. You little bastards.
bastards. <laughs> Get into some automated battles. Okay. Alright, jamming so the Sultan Raider ain't gonna work. Oop. Oh, camera. Okay. Uh, okay, so. Chap grenades. Uh. Oop, okay, I didn't notice that. Holy crap. level I'm gonna have to get rations because I got one I know I can stealthily go back through other areas and, and get other rations and everything because I have one of five oh look we got the got the Ravens flying around, so I'm gonna be getting into a battle with that Vulcan Raven guy. He's gonna have a big, huge minigun. Snake, I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. You do? Okay. Her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry. The Don't worry, it is. Off. It's okay. secure. What's up? It's secure enough. I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. What did you say? It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on, even a high school student could see past it. The head of the FBI at that time, Edgar Hoover, he was a well-known racist. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. Well, back then there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 1950s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But you better check it out. The chief of the president mysteriously dying, and that ninja, too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? Could if it I be? find out anything, I'll call. Could it be? In the meantime, be oh. careful. Oh, always try to be careful. I don't think there's any cameras in this little area down here. You know, kind of too cold for cameras. Nope, don't see any. Let's get the thermal goggles out and look around. 
There's items behind the crates. Nikita Missile, C4. There's a ration. Nikita Missiles. Okay, so. <clears throat> ba -ba -ba -ba. See. Can't use it here. Let's just start off by just having that equipped. <laughs> oh, okay, let's do another save with Mei Ling. Naomi. Hmm? She's fine, I guess. What's up? Oh. <clears throat> what do you want, Snake? If you want to He's talk like, to oh, Naomi, nothing. why don't you call her? Oh, it's nothing. Um, Forget about it. Strange guy. Oh. Oh, I had to take a drink. <clears throat> Good luck, Snake. Thank you. She's so sweet. Fight with a big guy. Welcome, Cossack. This is the end of the road for you. Right, my friends? <clears throat> yes, they agree. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world, that which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> but that was no clue <clears throat> at all. <sighs> the red and big freaking minigun. See what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The ravens say you are a true warrior. Mm. I have it, Snake. Put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Mm. Ah, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. I don't have any crows in my family tree. You jest, but indeed ravens and snakes are not the best of friends. Nevertheless, you will make a worthy adversary. Mm -hmm. You live in Alaska too. You know of the world Eskimo Indian Olympics. Yeah, I know it. it must be a real threat in the muck duck eating contest. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pool. It is an pull. event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. <clears throat> you want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will just picture two guys standing right in front of each other. This isn't glorious. It's just pulling like on each other's ears, getting in major freaking pain in the freaking freezing cold. That's just plain dumb. <laughs> I wouldn't do it. Okay. Okay, so so Hit one of them. 
He's just gonna shoot everything up. Oops. He saw me. Ow. Bastard. Oh, damn it, I ran into my own crap. Oh, damn it. doing there dude damn it okay stick to uh my clean mars oh ow I didn't see you there holy crap dude Really running now, ain't it? Pretty good with the claymores. Oh, he went the other way. Watch 
where I put the claymores. <clears throat> Okay. I still only had just one frickin' ration. I know there's like another ration or two. On top of the dang thing, you know? On top of the things that he destroys. I can skip all his crap. <clears throat> okay. Well, I was doing pretty good with the Claymores. Uh... He will eventually go everywhere, though. Oh, look, fashion. See if he's gonna go. run into it or Okay. 
Let that go. Oh, you bastard. Oh, damn. Ran into my own freaking Claymore. Crap. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do when I, you know, some of my Claymores. I'm going to re-equip my freaking thermal goggles so I know where my damn therm... Well, I know where they are. I just put them all along the outsides or something. Or I could just... Any C4. Well, I could do the C4. Yeah, I think that'd be better to do the C4. Because with the C4, of course, press square to set it down and then X to detonate them. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll use my C4. <clears throat> Make sure I get close enough to him to, uh, to the corner and get that ration.
guys. <clears throat> oh, damn it. Bastard. He's just shooting everything up, ain't he? Since frozen crap, I need to to dry up. <laughs> oh, damn it! There's a ratchet right there. Oh, you bastard. Damn it. The damn rations got frozen. Crap. Okay, so wait to pick up that other one. Almost had him beat, though. Almost had him beat. Oh, I ran into a little alcove and got stuck, you know. He shouldn't have been able to freaking look there. So. Wait until I need to pick up that other ration because I doubt it'll freeze. So here we go again. Third time's a charm. Frickin' turn around and shoot it. My what ammo you got there, buddy. Do a lot of damage to him with that, though. See this way he's gonna go. Okay, he's going that way. He's going back up that way. Damn it! Oh shit! I turned it the wrong damn way.
Okay, maybe you stick to my uh, Claymore plan. Which way are you going? Oh, he just went right by it? Turn around with the other way, coward. Uh, rations frozen. But that was not frozen. Yeah, the frozen melt before you eat. Uh, you gotta go in the warm freaking area. Oh, you bastard. God damn. Shit. got freaking frozen and I couldn't use them that's bullcrap maybe I gotta have them equipped to get them warm that's it gotta have them equipped to get them warm <clears throat> I think I think you have to have them equipped that's so freaking bogus Such a pain in the freaking butt. If you keep them equipped, they'll be warm, so. <clears throat> OK, 
Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Alright, let's just set the claymores at different spots. I'm just glad I'm with it in the field, so. Really? Couldn't even move in time, he started shooting. Stayed right there for now. Oh, damn it, really? So I don't think if I miss with it, it won't be frozen. Just start running. <clears throat> Let's 
收一点吧。down here. <clears throat> Why's he going that way? Got him. Ha ha. <laughs> Just as the boss said, it is my existence. I was being very cautious about uh, putting the claim words down and everything. You run into your own freaking minds. My body will not remain in this place. My spirit. I think controls would have been better back then, you know, where you could. You can draw that Nikita missile a lot better. But he turns around, he freaking shoots it and it blows up. He should have took damage anyway. You know, being the explosion is close. that one uh, door security level seven you know way on the outside you are from another I think that one has like little trap doors and um, security cameras I know there's got to be a special item in there so I'm gonna be making my way back there first I'll give you a hint the man you saw die before your eyes Yeah, in the jail cell. That was not the Darpa chief. Uh -oh. It was Decoy Octopus, a member of Foxhound. He was a master of disguise. He copied his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. But he wasn't able to deceive the Angel of Death. The Angel of <clears throat> Death? <clears throat> the Angel of Death. <clears throat> but why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the chief? <laughs> That is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. Oh, yeah. Snake. <clears throat> and 
natural world, there's no such thing as boundless slaughter. There's always oh, the ravens are going to eat him. You are different. What are you trying to say? The path you walk on has no end. Each step you take is paved with the corpses of your enemies. Their souls will haunt you forever. You shall have no peace. <clears throat> His spirit will be watching. <clears throat> well, I know how the rations can become unfrozen. Just, uh... Snake, <clears throat> it's me, Master. It's about Go to the warmer area and then boom. Off. What about Naomi? <clears throat> Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Hmm. So what is this about Naomi? Okay, maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah, go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? Hmm. I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there, there was, was one. one. There was she's one. She's not the woman we know. The real <clears throat> Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So mm. then who is she really? She must be some kind of spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? Mm. I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. A different, different group. group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's <clears throat> one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Ooh, big trouble. Uh, nothing. <clears throat> Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. <clears throat> Hurry then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. What is she doing here? Snake, uh -uh. give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. <gasps> oh, no time. <gasps> okay, so those rations are frozen. But if I pick that one up, it still shows frozen. So they're going to have to be warmed. Let's get that gone, cause... Don't want to run into my, uh... Claymores that I did have set that I didn't use. I think all the plane ones are gone. I thought he shot all the rest of them down. But... Just looking everywhere in there. have full life but the those are frozen so oh level seven key card I should go back <clears throat> to that one there. 
area. Get this stuff reappeared here. Nope, they sure didn't. outside to that door that was level seven. <clears throat> I know I'll be using some chaps to get through there. There's like two of five. <clears throat> I think two of five. Takes a while to get up the elevator. like chaff. Nope, ration. Come on, we'll freaking go. back to the outside where the snow is and of course my uh Something back in here. Yep. Fama's almost full. Outside, avoid them guys. <clears throat> oh, well, I'm in this warmer area, I can unfreeze the rations. 
as it says. Melt it before you eat. See, they're unpros. Okay, let's. Okay. He's not glitched no more. Woo. He don't see me. Can't shoot him though. So he goes back the other way. <clears throat> Wait till that thing gets back over past me. Oh, just a box. Just a box. It's gonna say oh, insert disc one. Oh no, not yet. It's not okay. So so combo it's okay. okay. Back outside. Ooh, there's a camera. The little baby will be. <laughs> the little wolf pup. Okay, that was level six. Where was the level seven? Over here. Six. I know one of them was seven. I think it was this one. Yep, level seven. See? Cameras up above. Okay. All right, just stinger muscles in that one. I have three rations. I know I can get two others. <clears throat> Hope I go all back through there. They might just respawn. Mm. Let's see. Um, I think there was a ration on the ground. 
the ground floor, inside, inside this building here. Go back to the night. There should be a ratchet there. I need to get ratchets. to the last four of that. Chaps, just open the ding doors. Then, uh, don't get hurt. <clears throat> we got six chap grenades, I don't know about it anymore. We're healing. <clears throat> there we go. Rash. 
crash in. I'll go around here and just see it. Okay. Now the door. G1 boards. I know what those are. Maybe that one ration still over there on that side. Maybe. Because there was one over here with the battle with Sniper Wolf. Yep, right there. All rations are full. There's that little wolf cup. Wolf puppy. Little puppy wolf. trees okay um which door was it to get more chaps definitely <clears throat> that's that's more chap grenades more chap grenades. Not those. Oh, I think there's... Let's not worry about that. <clears throat> that guy patrolling down there. I bet there's chap grenades down there. Over here in the corner, he ain't gonna walk over here. I don't think. No. the box. Now walk away. Oh, we still 
don't have to worry about him. See a ration right there. You would have to nudge up against the wall to go to it. Stun grenades. I want chaps. More freaking chaps. Any more tap grenades? Damn it. Tap grenades. Okay. Alright. Keep all my sports. You gotta be happy things respawn. Throw a tap. Claymores are freaking back again. I got two chap grenades, so I'm gonna need more. <clears throat> Claymores full. Ration back to being full. Grenades, tons. Okay. <clears throat> Don't remember if there was any chaff grenades around in here or not. I doubt it. 
I'll run around and look though. Just to be cautious. Look on both sides of uh, these. Okay, nothing else is in here. <clears throat> oh yeah, touch the cameras. Do you have grenades? Cause there's a bunch of cameras there. See? <clears throat> and there's a ration there too. Oh shit! Okay, I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> I so totally forgot about that. God, I just ran right into that crap. Okay, um. Yeah, see? Okay. See a couple trap doors. So. Go on the end. I should only need one. Okay, I think there might have been an item over on the other side, so I'm not sure. There probably was. Okay, there'll be no more cameras there. So, get back on his usual cell comm. There we go, little cutscene. <clears throat> Good. Gonna need them. Okay, there's a camera there. Oh, I think you have to... Yeah, at some point you do have to go in that water, I think. That's why there's a camera there. Let's go around the other side. Okay, I think there might be something in the water. I'm not sure. Oh shit. What's the poisonous freaking water? Okay, so. You don't want to spend much time in there. Okay, Kodak call. Snake, it's me. What's wrong? Did you find a good place to hide? Yeah, thanks to the stealth gear. It looks like they've finished getting Metal Gear ready. How do you know that? I overheard them talking. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear, but it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards. Nobody patrolling. It's too quiet. Maybe because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do is use the override system that President Baker told mm. you about. But I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave hmm. it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Okay. Baker's files. Don't you need a password? Of course, but there are ways. Are you a hacker? <laughs> that describes me pretty well. Does it look like you can get in? I don't know yet. I'll give it a try. I'm counting on you. They gotta do their little hacking skills, get through all the firewalls and security stuff and everything. <laughs> mm-hmm. All that. Okay. Okay. Jamming in this area. Got more captain aid. So how many I got now? Ten. Got ten chapters. More promise bullets. Snake, it's me again. 
How's it going? Uh, not bad. I just got past his third security level. He was a pretty careful guy. Do you think mm -hmm. he'll break in soon? I never met a system I couldn't bust into. Okay, keep trying. Hmm. Yeah, turn them experienced hackers into government agents working on a computer. Hacking all into the system. Online slowage. More chapter and eight, good. The more the better. of Metal Gear to the other side. I think I have to set up the way that other. Okay. Snake, I did it. You got past security? Bingo. Great. Bingo. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. So what about the PAL override system that Baker talked about? I haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. But Snake, I found something else. What? Dead. The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. Hmm. It doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Hmm. Yes, but Yeah, effective. very sneaky. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. A stealth you weapon. Show up on radar. Yeah. Ooh. The truth is they've been working on a stealth, stealth missile weapon. since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one until <clears throat> now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system, it would be picked up by enemy satellites. It oh, would. Yeah. That makes hmm. sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. <clears throat> An invisible <clears throat> nuclear warhead. Totally <clears throat> impossible <throat> to intercept. And on top of that, it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. Yeah, we learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? <clears throat> I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START III treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know this, Colonel? I'm sorry. You changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean they ran a computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Do you still have it? No. Hmm. Ocelot took it from me. Yeah, Ocelot took it. <sighs> the terrorists have replaced the dummy warhead with a real warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they should they be ready to launch. Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real hmm. thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. We're counting on you. Okay. Just looking to be sure. Ooh, there's a guy. Oh, 
he dropped Farmer's Bowls and I use these. Okay, more so combo us. <clears throat> Snake, did you find yeah. it? Yeah. No, I haven't found out about the override system yet, but I found Baker's ulterior motive. Well, you did. He's just looking to get rich, isn't he? Well, of course. Arms Tech is in much worse financial trouble than I thought. Oh, they are. They they're in debt. To make the next generation so they're doing this to make money to get out of debt. In SDI spending. It looks like there was even some talk of a hostile takeover. Everything was riding on this project, I guess. And it looks like we were paying a lot of bribe money to the DARPA chief. Bribe money, huh? Yeah. And Baker was a big proponent of the nuclear deterrent theory. I see. So anyway, what about the override? Just give me a little bit longer. Okay. Give him a little bit longer. I don't know if there's another guy on the other side. Codes and disengage the safety device. We can you launch any time. There's still launch no response time. from Washington. Well, of course, you Looks won't get like one. We'll have to show them that we mean business. Should I set it for Chernotin, Russia? Oh. No. There's been a change. The new target is Lopnor, China. Lop -Nor Why, China. boss? I'm sure oh. neither you nor Mr. Golukovich would really like to see a nuclear bomb dropped on your motherland, right? Oh, no. Liquid. But why? There's nothing there. Wrong. Also a lot. Nuclear test site. A nuclear test site. A nuclear if test we site. a major population center, the game's hmm. over. But a nuclear explosion at a test site can still be concealed from the public. Meanwhile, Washington will be worried about the retaliatory strike from China. That'll probably hmm. mean top secret talks between both countries' leaders. Of course. And in the process, the president will be forced to divulge the existence of a new and highly destabilizing nuclear weapon to the Chinese. What do you think that will do to the U.S.'s reputation? Or the president's? And with the CTBT, that oh. means that China and India. I see. Yes. When the mm. other countries hear about this new weapon, mm. they'll all want to contact us. Washington won't be very happy when we start selling their own system to the highest bidders. <laughs> yes. President will break. He will give in to our demands. Big boss think? DNA and one billion dollars. <laughs> that money will be used to cure our genome soldiers as well. I'm also including the <clears throat> Fox Dye vaccine in our demands. Fox Dye. It killed Octopus and the Arms Tech President. So it's true that it affects older people first. Oh, possibly. Mantis might not have been affected because he wore a mask. Wolf wasn't infected either. Perhaps due to those tranquilizers she always took. <laughs> Something to do with the adrenaline level in the blood. Yeah, possibly. Maybe it's just because this fox dye was still experimental and they haven't worked out all the bugs yet. In mm. any case, have you heard from your friend, Colonel Sergei Golukovich, at the Spetsnaz? <laughs> he still has doubts about the ability of Metal Gear. He said we can talk after Metal Gear's test launch is successful. Mm -hmm. He's a very prudent man. Oh, well, I guess There's he is. There's nothing to worry about. The Colonel wants Metal Gear and a new nuclear weapon so bad he can taste it. If Russia wants to regain its position as a military superpower, they need to reinforce their nuclear arsenal. They mm -hmm. need a nuclear weapon that can't be intercepted. Metal Gear will allow them to gain first strike capability over the rest of the world. Their regular army is in shambles, and they think they can restore their country's military power with nuclear weapons? Golukovich, he's no warrior. He's a politician. Well, he's the one who gave us the hind and most of our other heavy firepower. He's got over a thousand soldiers under his command. If we join forces, we could put up mm -hmm. quite a resistance here. 
Since Mantis died, the genome soldier's brainwashing has started to wear off. I'm worried oh. about the man's morale. An oh, yeah. Alliance with the Russians would boost that as well. What do you say? We're not <laughs> going anywhere. We're going to dig in here. We can still escape. We've got the most powerful weapon ever made, and we're about to ally with Galukovich's forces. Are you going to fight the whole world? <laughs> What's wrong with that? We can launch a nuclear warhead at any target on this planet. A nuclear warhead invisible to radar. And on top of that, this base is full of spare nuclear warheads. Once we get the DNA mm. and the money, the world will be ours. What about your promise to Colonel Golukovich? I have no interest in the revival of Mother Russia. You're not thinking of reviving Big Boss's dream. Or do they call this place Outer Heaven. Hmm. Big Boss's dream. But boss, Outer heaven. you're not worried about the PAL being overridden. If the code is in it again, it'll be deactivated. No need to worry. The DARPA chief and the arms tech president are both dead. Oh, look. The they can see him on his range camera. You interrogated him, don't you know? He didn't have any keys on him. Good. Then no one can stop Metal Gear now. By the way, hmm. what should we do with that woman? Want me to kill her? Let her live. She's Campbell's niece, and Snake cares for her. We'll keep her as our ace in the hole. Meryl. She's alive. <clears throat> yep. Yep, not submitting in the torture. Snake, Meryl lives, and you, you know, you files. have her at the end Great of it. Job. But if you I'll submit, then the PAL codes. Uh, supposedly so she dies, and you'll have Otacon at okay. the end. Of course, with Meryl at the end, after completion, you'll get a bandana to have a unlimited bit of ammo. And ending with Otacon, you'll get the stealth camo, so you'll be able to move around and everything without being spotted. So you can do multiple playthroughs to get these extra items, these special items you can use. We don't have much time, but it takes three keys, right? I've only got one of them. Hold on a minute. You see, that's the trick. You already have all three keys. What are you talking about? The card key is made of a shape memory alloy. Shape memory alloy? Hmm. Yes. It's a material that changes shape at different temperatures. The key is made out of it. This card key? Yeah. The card key changes hmm. shape at different temperatures. So this key is actually three keys in one. Clever. Can you see the input terminals in the center of the control room? I see them. Those three laptop terminals are for the emergency input. There should be a symbol on each screen. Mm -hmm. Each symbol corresponds to a different key. Input the keys Yellow, in order blue, from left red. to right. So you got the left ones for the room temperature key. Room temperature. See the symbol? Next to that goes the low Cold. temperature key. The one on the right is the high temperature. The red, that's hot. Okay, I got it. First, so, I change the shape room temperature, the warm, and you know, order. cold and hot. That's right. All you do is insert the card keys. After you insert the key into the module, a hard disk reads the information contained on it. Once you've finished with all three terminals, the code input process <clears> is complete. But here's the thing. You can only use the key three times. It's an emergency system. It's only meant to be used once. World is riding on that key, Snake. Damn. Oh crap, the key. <sighs> the key fell on the drainage ditch. Snake, this is bulletproof glass. There's no way in. I'll enjoy watching you die. Yeah. <laughs> Snake, you've got to get that key. Hmm. Oh. Oh, damn it.
you gonna come up? <clears throat> I guess he not. was there. for other guards. Let's see if there's any other guards. Okay, the key went into the train just down there. And I think I would have to probably wear maybe the gas mask. goggles side. Kind of weird how everything's jammed up above but not down below. Always wondered about that. Well, get in line with the freaking ladder. Yeah, there's a guard on the other side. Where's 
Maybe here in this spot. Nope, he didn't respawn. Oh, if I'd leave the room, come back in, then he'd respawn. Uh oh. I need my muscle combo. It's battered. Well, I don't want to shoot the farmhouse though. It'll attract more guards. Confirmed. Awaiting PAL code number two. Number okay. two. Okay, that takes care of PAL code number one. Now, PAL number two, freeze the key. Freeze the key. after again. Oh what I had to have one guard out there kind of stupid. Easier just to kill him. <laughs> of course could like a uh, get all like sneaky and everything and you know, sneak up behind him without a weapon equipped and then you tap you know the square button to you know choke him save ammo Now at the freeze key, so just get into that uh, little area where you fought against Vulcan Raven, you know, because that's cold there. side <clears throat> I stand here and because <clears throat> it's cold in here so you let the pal code 
with the key turned like that the bluish color you know because it's cold in here so or unless you have to go all the way outside but i don't think you have to go all the way outside i think just in here yeah you see it's changing Well, because the rations got frozen in here, so it's cold in here. It should work. Unless you have to go all the way outside. Because I know that first room where, you know, pretty hot, you know, it's like you stand like over the edge. You know, by where all that heat, and then it'll change to the red one. Okay, there it is. See, it's cold now. <clears throat> I got to get that ration. Oh no, I won't need ration. I think there was like another room up there. I think there was another room right up there, so. Stupid freaking guard. Guess he'll be back. You don't want to take too long because then the card will go back to room temperature again. All you gotta do is just face the computer. It'll automatically do it. They're now hot. Probably get by him. I 
but the one outside. The one outside, though. See, they're showing that damn guard out there again. What was that noise? Huh? What was that noise? I'm just tapping it. Looks like while moving. into like a new little section that takes the uh, alertness away. Goddamn. Drop my bullet, you freaking moron. Okay, now I gotta go warm the key. Worm the key. No. <clears throat> and you could always get on top of, uh, you know, Metal Gear here, you know, just be knelt down because apparently it's like, you know, the enemy soldier NBCs, they can't climb freaking ladders. No, they can't climb ladders. Amazing, huh? <laughs> they can't come after you. Some SOCOM bullets somewhere. I just don't remember where. <coughs> I can get more though. <coughs> okay. Arissa's on Rogue Company. Trey on Rogue Company. Got his moody. She's on Fortnite. Probably doing the Fortnite Festival, the music thing. Nerdy, she's on Rogue Company. Curry on Rogue Company. Jeez, everybody, holy crap. I think it might have been some other type of item over on the other side. There might have been, I don't know. Nope, they're in. Okay. I was just checking, you know, I was curious, you know. There was some on one side, but not on the other. Okay, chap grenades. Yeah, back to heaven for not very many. But I know, you know, like the rooms, you know, from the outside, they have them, so. <clears throat> Okay, just uh, ammo I already have. Run! Run like a little bitch! Oh man. Ooh. Okay. Wow. Oh damn, there's guys in here. Three of them. 
All right. Bastards. Okay, I forgot they put guys in there. Holy crap. Okay, I'm gonna use a couple, so. Kind of weird, they didn't put any guys in here. I don't think I would want to. Out here in the freezing freaking cold. Gonna need more chapter nades. You know, a lot of what I don't really need. See, four rations. I know I can get another ration. Okay. I know there's one time you get on these lifts. I think I already had that. Yeah, the guys that got on here when I first got on. I don't know if there'll be another little encounter of guards getting on there again, but being ready because I'll, I'll run around, toss stun grenades, <laughs> keep stunning them. Snake, it's about Naomi Hunter. About you Naomi. Talk to the colonel. He's looking into it. Yeah, he's look, off. Colonel's looking into it. Okay, it's off. No one else can hear us. Go ahead. Sorry, but I didn't want the Colonel to hear. Oh, okay, you didn't? so what's up? Okay. I've got a good friend in the Pentagon. Yeah. He's the one who told me about it. It looks like the DIA recently developed a new type of assassination weapon. An assassination weapon? A new one. Snake, have you ever heard of something called Fox Die? Fox Die. No. Fox dye. Liquid and the others were talking about it. Yeah. It's some kind of virus that, that targets specific people. I don't know all the details, but what are you trying to say? Mm. It's too similar. What too is similar? The cause of death. Didn't the arms tech president and the DARPA chief, I mean decoy octopus, die of something that looked like a heart attack? Yeah. Well... Apparently, Fox Die kills its hmm. victims by simulating a heart attack. No. Really? You're wow. telling me that Naomi was behind it? Snake, try to remember. Uh, uh, Did Naomi give you some kind of injection? The nanomachines. She was in the best position to have done it, but I don't know hmm. what her motive was. Does the Colonel know? I'm not sure. But he still hasn't questioned her. Okay. I'll ask him myself. Colonel, what's new with the Naomi situation? I just placed Naomi under arrest. Arrest? She was sending coded mm. messages towards the Alaskan base. I didn't want to believe it, but she must be working with the terrorists. Are you I sure? See. I'm afraid so. She's being interrogated now. What kind of interrogation? Well, I'd like to avoid the rough stuff. We don't even have any sodium pentothal here. Call me if you find out anything. So it's true, isn't it? Naomi, I can't believe it. That means the Fox Dye vaccine must be around somewhere. Listen, I've got bigger things to worry about. But Snake, you might be infected too, you know. All I can do is leave it up to the Colonel. Leave it up to the Colonel. <clears throat> yeah, leave it up to the Colonel. Okay. Uh, Alright, this is the one where the Claymore mines are on the floor. Oh, you stupid little freaking thing. Glad it missed me. All my bullets. Okay, crawl on the ground. Avoid. Getting blown up by the clean waters. Even though I'm full of them. Okay. Oh, another rack and coal. And I'm full. See, 
that's up there. But I think that might be. Oh. I might be able to just sneak right under it. Oh, maybe not. Damn thing. Jesus Christ. Oh. <clears throat> Might not have to fight the guards again, but put the armor on. And I got two chap grenades. here. Silk on bullets. Okay, nothing on both sides there. Famas, which I don't need. Famas that I don't need. More silk on. More famas that I don't need. Turn red. Oh shit! <laughs> I get no job with this. Oh damn it! Really? And I take it the right and I just died. <laughs> oh god. Jesus, Crowny. Ways to die in Metal Gear. Ways to die in Metal Gear. Well, I think let's not worry about it because I think, um,. But I know you can shimmy against the damn wall there. Uh-huh. Yeah, you can shimmy against the wall and get that. But it's not easy. It's not. It's not easy. Well, let's not worry about it, because... I know I should be able to get more. Just stand over here and until that turns red. I know I've gotten them before, it just it's a pain in the butt. 
major pain in the butt. Okay, got it. Okay. Ooh, all right. Okay, just stand here where it's freaking warm. Okay, it's red, so... Got two chaff grenades. Something's gonna happen after doing a third. I do remember something happens. Indeed. I think the ration is on the right side will be back. But I think, you know, in the, that next room where I fought um, Volk and Raven with all them boxes. Snake, can you hear me? It's Naomi. Naomi. Naomi? What the hell? Campbell and the others are busy right now. I'm on a different codec. Naomi, is what the Colonel says true? Yes. But not everything I said was a lie. Who are you? I don't know hmm. myself. I don't know my hmm. real name or even what my parents looked like. I bought all my identification. But my reason for getting into genetics was true. Because you want to know yourself, right? Uh -huh. That's right. I want to know where I came from. My, my age, my race, anything. Anything. Naomi. I was found in Rhodesia sometime <clears throat> in the 80s. A dirty little orphan. Rhodesia? What's now known as Zimbabwe? Yes. Rhodesia was owned by England until 1965, and there were lots of Indian laborers around. That's probably where I got my skin color from, but I'm not even sure about that. Naomi, you're too worried about the past. Isn't it enough to understand who you are now? Understand who I am now? Why should I? No one else tries to understand me. I was alone for <clears throat> so long. Until I met my big brother. And him. Your big brother? Yes. Frank Yeager. What? He was a young soldier. When he picked me up near the Zambezi River. I was half dead from starvation mm. and he shared his rations with me. Yes. Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. No. Gray Fox? We survived that hell together, Frank and I. He protected mm. me. He's my one connection. The only connection I have to my past. And he brought you back to America? No. I was in Mozambique when he came. Who is he? You mean Big Boss? Yes. He brought us to this land of freedom, this America. And then he and my brother went back to Africa to continue the war. And that's when it happened. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge and joined Foxhound. Mm. I knew it was my best chance to meet you and I prayed for the day that I would. So were your prayers answered? 
Yes. I waited two long years. To kill two me. whole years. Is that all you cared about? Yes. That's hmm. right. Two years. Two you whole were all years. I thought about for two long years. Like some kind of twisted obsession. You still <gasps> hate me. Oh, God. <sighs> Not exactly. I was partly wrong about you. What about Liquid and the others? <laughs> I'll have my revenge on them, too. Naomi, <clears throat> you didn't kill that doctor, too, did you? The one that used Gray Fox for his genome experiments? Dr. Clark? No. That was my brother. Afterwards, I covered it up and helped him hide out. So that ninja... <clears throat> I mean, Gray Fox... He's come here to kill me? I don't think so. I think he just came here to fight you. I wasn't sure before, but now I think I understand. A final battle with you. That's all he lives for. I'm <laughs> sure of it. Fox, no. Naomi, tell me something. About Fox Dye? Fox Dye is a type of retrovirus that targets and kills only specific people. First, it infects the macrophages in the victim's body. Fox dye contains smart enzymes created through protein engineering. They're programmed to respond to specific genetic patterns in the cells. Hmm. Those enzymes recognize the target's DNA? Right. They respond by becoming active and using the macrophages they begin creating TNF Epsilon. Huh? It's a type of cytokine, a peptide which causes cells to die. The TNF Epsilon is carried along the bloodstream to the heart, where they attach to Destroy the TNF receptors in the heart cells. And then, they cause a heart attack? The heart cells suffer a shock and undergo oh. an extreme apoptosis. Then, the victim dies. Apoptosis? The victim you mean dies. heart cells commit suicide? Naomi. What? You must have programmed that thing to kill me too, right? Do I still have time? Do we have time? Naomi. I don't blame you for wanting me dead. But I can't go Is there yet. time? I still have a job to do. Is there time? Listen, Snake. I'm not the one who made the decision to use Fox Dye. Huh? You weren't? No. You were injected with Fox Dye as a part mm. of this operation. I just wanted to let you know that. No, that's mm. not the whole truth. Uh -huh. The real thing I wanted to tell you was... Snake, I... Oh. I... Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> oh. Snake! <gasps> Naomi! Snake, mm. I can't allow Naomi to make any more unauthorized transmissions. What? Naomi's been removed from this operation. What happened to Naomi? What did she mean when she said that Fox Dye was a part of this operation? Colonel, let me know. talk to her. I won't. She's <clears throat> under arrest. Colonel, you double-crossed me. Snake, there's no time for that. Right now, your job is to stop Metal Gear. Okay, Snake? Ooh. I have one chap grenade. Okay, here's the winner thing. I won't need no chap in here. I think I'll be able to get another weapon on the other side of it. No, I'll go to another side. Because I know I'm going to need to get more chap grenade. You know, for fighting Metal Gear. Oh, I thought there was another freaking ration on the side. Don't no. damn it. Okay. Um. All right. Now I know there's guys in here. Where you going? Going that way.
Don't come in this way. Okay. He's going to hide. Okay. So. That was close. Okay. Alright. Cool. Capital H. Okay. In this area. Yes. The cap is needed. Straight to the door. Straight to the door. Okay. Oh, now to this room. <clears throat> worry about you know, the one guy patrolling This is where I'm gonna Snake, Naomi, save. What the hell is happening over there? What's the colonel thinking? Campbell, is... <clears throat> I'm sorry, I can't say anymore. But please believe me, I'm here to help you until the until end. The end. Now save. Please, Snake, <clears throat> don't give up. Don't give up. Don't worry, I won't. Okay, this here is where I'm gonna stop for now and then on the next part i'll uh, actually work toward finishing the game because i think shortly after i put the third one in there's going to be a boss battle with the metal gear and then i think you have to fight liquid snake and then do like an escape thing and everything and and then there'll be end credits and all that stuff so uh the next stream is going to be the last for Metal Gear Solid 1, so appreciate everybody who did come out and show me some support. And as I always say at the end of uh, live streams and videos, everyone stay safe, happy, and healthy, have fun gaming, and I'll see y'all later. Bye for now, everybody.